Hey guys, welcome back to Tools on a Budget. Uh, today I got a a off brand. It's um, it's made by Viol Works, but it, this one goes under uh, quite a few names. Um, and honestly, this is probably the strongest impact you're gonna find for under hundred dollars. Um, it's actually quite it's surprising. The first time I saw this one was on uh, I think it was Torque Test Channel, and uh, they tried out. The, it's it goes under the name CC. Um, and they were quite impressed with it and actually I'm quite impressed too. I've used this quite a bit already as you can tell it does have some use in it um, Not as much as like this one, but uh This one here will run circles around this one um, Lengthwise uh, The bower is longer the anvil hits about here um, But this one is bigger than let's say like a Milwaukee Half inch. This is this is the Gen One uh, mid torque, and it is quite a bit. Uh, the mid torque is a little bit smaller, and then uh, compared to a Gen Two, there's just no comparison. But I mean, for you're not going to be able to find these Milwaukee's for um, the price you can find this one. Um, I can. I'm gonna link the eBay link for this one uh, in the description, and I'm also gonna link you guys the CC uh, if you guys want to get it off Amazon. Um, I know some people don't like ordering stuff off eBay. Uh, there's I'll, I'll, there's another orange brand. I forgot what it's called. Um, Torque Test Channel. I'll also link that one. But yeah, this one's actually um, it's a great tool. It actually hits extremely hard for uh, for the money. And you can even hear it. Uh, you can hear the power in that one. This bower is a lot bigger, but honestly, this is probably twice as strong as this one. And it doesn't give you that nasty uh, worn brush smell. And um, yeah, I've used this to take off like, axle nuts, suspension parts. It's not going to take everything off because even the Milwaukee's don't. Um, you're still going to need like a bigger half inch, like the 2767, 2763, etc. Um, but this is actually like an all around 95%. It'll do 95% of what you need. Uh, the only downfall are these batteries, which um, they're fine. They just don't last. Let's say I fully charge both of these. Uh, this one's going to last me about like 1.5 times as long. So this one might be able to do like three cars and that one to do like four and a half. Um, apart from that, I mean, these batteries, the, the good thing about these is um, any Chinese impact you get, um, they're all the same battery. Um, I can show you guys. It don't matter. It don't matter. Ah, all these cheaper brands, they are, they're all similar. Ah, one second. All right, guys, so I'm back. Yeah, uh, sorry about that. Uh, my thing is out for delivery today, so I'll be able to use the phone holder on the next video. Let's see. See, so you just plug it into any one of these bad, cheap batteries. Honestly, you could probably get these for like $10. So you could always have one on the charger. So I really don't see that as a problem. I do notice these are a little bit better than ones that look more like the Makita knockoffs. These kind of drain a little bit faster than these. It could just be uh, different batches, different uh, uh, variations and stuff. And sorry if I sound a little bit off. I'm a little bit under the weather right now. Uh, we all went on a vacation and ended up getting a little bit sick. Uh, these, you know, these kids be touching everything. But yeah. Um, so I'm going to do a... Uh, I don't really have anything to test the power of this. I can show you guys. Um, I'm going to try to go to the junkyard tomorrow and then see what this can uh, take off that'll be a separate video and um for right now i'm just gonna do a lag bolt test we're gonna drive some lag bolts i'm gonna put it up against the first gen and if it's able to defeat the first gen we're gonna go ahead and put it up against the second gen so let's go ahead and uh, start that fully charged you can't check on this one. All right, here we go.
So there you go, guys. As you guys saw, it's actually pretty powerful. Um, especially considering I bought this night for $92, um, which including shipping and taxes. I believe it was like 80 something with free shipping. But yeah, it's it's pretty decent. I've I've owned it quite a like like three months. Now long longevity wise, um, it's not gonna compare to like a Milwaukee or Dewalt or Makita, but I can see this as being uh, great for the DIYer, um, homeowner, the one that maybe does a few uh, jobs here and there. Um, having one of these in the car is great because uh, this one will take off pretty much all every wheel, unless someone tightens on there with like a high torque, you know. Uh, at that point, you know even. Other high torques you might even just snap the the lug nuts off uh, but as you saw it's pretty comparable to the to this one even I would say a little bit stronger than this one uh, this one did shut off once during um, the lag bolt against this one and then uh, for some reason it lost pretty hard against this one because I believe it, ha it got like a, a hard spot in the grain in the wood um, but yeah it's, it's a pretty decent tool uh, I recommend it. Uh, like I said, I'm going to leave a link in the description um, for this one, the CC, and then the other one from Amazon. Um, they're all the same. And then I think Torque Test Channel found an even stronger one um, than this one. And it's like 150 So it's, um, it's not bad. Um, like I said, it's pretty it's a pretty good tool so far. I haven't had any issues with it. Um, that was actually the first time it ever shut off on me and I'm guessing it has some more to do with the battery overheating than with the actual tool because like I said these cells are extremely cheap um, you can just use any cells from any of these uh, Chinese impacts and pretty much slide it on and it'll work uh, but yeah guys also don't forget uh, I have the upcoming giveaway for a thousand subscribers thank you guys for helping me get to a thousand um, couldn't have done it without all you guys and remember, if you guys haven't uh, seen that video, I'm going to link it in the description. Um, all you got to do is subscribe and comment, and you're eligible to eligible to win a uh, DeWalt Impact 12 volt with like two batteries, charger, and a bag. Um, so stay tuned for that one. Remember, guys, if you like this type of video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up or a like, uh, comment, anything. If you guys really like it, subscribe. Um, once again, um, have a great day. Thank you.